Okay, our roof covering options are limited because um, of the height of the roof. So a 20 foot ladder can't get this, 17 they say, but a 20 foot ladder won't make it. Um, uh, drone is not possible. I don't do drones, but we are in a flight path, an airport flight path. So a drone would not be possible to view this roof. So we're gonna rely on a camera pole and even those observations are limited. There's not enough space in the backyard to extend the pole and utilize it. And um, we got a tree at the front. Let's see if we can get around that. But if, right now a camera pole is our best option. It's gonna be like a silent movie. Um, the satellite dish, however, is bolted directly to the roof. And uh, we're missing some kick out flashing where the vertical walls and um, front porch and fireplace chimney chase uh, meet the roof line and some of the apron flashing where the walls and chimney chase meet the roof line are um, they have some gaps underneath them from wind driven rain uh, one of the good things about this is that well bad things is with the kick out flashing some of the rain gutter butt ends are directly against the building but um, the underlayment was installed properly and it, um, the drip edge extends over the back sides of the rain gutters so you know get your pluses if you can find them we've got soffit vents and ridge vents on this structure and i'm gonna it's gonna get quiet now you're you're done with me i'm, I'm gonna take you we're gonna hop up there